take this out first let me introduce myself well of course you know it's a boy again and uh good morning good afternoon good evening depending on where you guys are watching this video from today is sunday please huh no matter what you are doing if you are a christian try to go to church it doesn't take a uh, few hours to spend in church so use it and have god in your heart go to church i know some of you like my friend we tell me that he doesn't like going to church because he believes so many church in nigeria are fake and i always advise him bro it is your intention look for a good church attend that church and go there having the intention that you are going there because of god you are going there because you want to worship god you want to listen to god's words then he said they pay tight all the time i said ah, i don't think it's by force to pay tight i know i've been to church though they do share envelope, uh, envelopes for you to put something into the envelope but i don't think it's false you can go there listen to god's word without even paying tight so don't let pain of tight be an excuse for you not to go to church as long as you have the intention and again you do not necessarily need to take any money to church just go there a lot of people want to pay tight to keep paying tight just go there and listen to the word of god and go back home you know we all need prayers most including myself as well i need your prayers guys and that your loved ones need your prayers so you are you hold them that obligation to pray for them and uh that's it guys so well you saw the title of this video and uh, the first picture that i that i showed well whiskey and jada you know i think it's kind of like disrespectful if anybody keeps calling jada whiskey baby mama although it's not official yet but i was told according to very good source very very good so sorry i'm not going to disclose my source because i promised him that they are officially married but they decided to do a very secret wedding and the reason why they were able to marry was because of uh whiskey to for whiskey to process his visa not sorry not visa to process his uh, green passport and also permanent residence so that they can travel around the globe to perform easily because you know as a nigeria artist eh, if you are doing well the next thing that you should be looking forward to have is a visa from this very respected country from any very respected country that has access to travel to multiple countries and the easiest best is the united states of america visa canada uh sorry the usa passport canadian passport uk passport yeah those are the best bet so i know what you guys know the easiest way but i'm just saying if you are a nigeria artist that is doing well the next thing on your plate should be how you will be traveling around the globe without stress because holding a nigeria passport will still also give you many many stress traveling they're still going to stop you one month scrutinize your way you get billions for inside account you know but that's just how it is guys very 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 not that great and meanwhile have you guys had ghana and south africa just finally came into conclusion for free visa entry to each other country Ghana, you can go to as a Ghanaian, you can go to South Africa now. Free visa entry. You don't pay nothing for visa and you don't even apply for a visa. You just go there, spend 90 days. After 90 days, you can reapply. So you can start applying for visa for longer stay. While in South Africa, also you can also come to Ghana free of charge. You then will just carry your passport, book a flight, and just come. You don't need to pay nothing 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 at all i was hoping that this will involve nigeria but unfortunately i don't know why they refused to add nigeria to the list you know i'll be looking forward to go to south africa for a very long time but that process of going through visa you know south africa uh, they can hold your passport for years <laughs> they have old people passport for years so i don't have that time 
South Africa need to do better. They need to start taking us as priority as Nigeria because they know if they allow Nigeria, that we will give them most of the money. They just have to put things in place to get Nigeria back because some people will not like to come back, you know, this kind of stuff. But let's forget about that. Let's talk about uh, the issue from Kenya, a fake lawyer. So this fake lawyer has been making headlines. Uh, recently, he was arrested. But after he was arrested, it was discovered that while practicing as a fake lawyer, this man has succeeded winning all his cases he has ever represented in court. Can you imagine? Imagine a fake lawyer winning all the cases he has ever represented in court. <laughs> Meanwhile, we have those uh, real lawyers who can hardly win a case. But this fake lawyer from Kenya has succeeded in winning all the cases he has ever represented in court. 26 cases so far. They say uh, his name is Brian Winder who faked being a lawyer in Kenya and won 26 cases, is now under arrest. What the hell? I think they should let this guy, this guy might decide to represent himself and still win that case. He might decide to represent himself and still win that case. Just imagine practicing as a fake lawyer and winning 26 cases so far. 26 cases you are represented. 26. It's like, for instance, you are a fake doctor, right? You are not, uh, you, didn't have the, you don't have this uh, license to operate. But yet, you are successful in operating. You are successful in operating patients. For example, you do not have any certificate, but you operate patient when they have uh, brain issues. You undergo brain surgery and you are successful. You have succeeded in operating 26 patients successfully. And then you will discover that you are not even a doctor, you are a fake doctor. But yet you have assisted, helped 26 people's life. Successful brain surgery. So tell me honestly, eh? tell me honestly, will you care if that man has certificate or not, let me say you are sick and you need that man help and that man has been successful so far. No loss of life. Will you care if that man has certificate? Don't you go to a native doctor that doesn't have certificate at all. No certificate. But you go to that native doctor because you know someone has recommended you that. That native doctor can heal your, heal, your illness. But you still go to this. So same thing with this uh, lawyer now. Certificate, no me. Hmm? Allow the guy to be practicing as long as he's winning cases. As long as he's winning cases, I might even, I might even be tempted to pay money for his bail. And this guy will even represent himself eh, and still win that case. Well, let me know exactly how you feel. And let's drop that aside. Let's talk about a woman. See, today is Sunday. Huh? Use it to advise yourself. Not all women deserve your stress. And also, vibes as well. Not all men deserve your stress. So check out this woman. A man wanted to take this woman out on a date. They went out on a date. And they, she was expecting this woman, this man, to take her to a very fancy restaurant due to the fact that this was their first date. But the guy took her to a normal restaurant. When they stopped, this guy came out. How did this girl to come out? The girl said, Lila, she's not coming out. So you cannot be taking me to this kind of low-life restaurant on our first date, according to the woman, the man should be able to go all out on our behalf. I can tell it's not gonna be there. I ha and maybe we're not right for each other. So respectfully, I'm gonna just drop you off at home. 
Oh no, he didn't. Yeah, I'm up. So you just want to call it a night? I mean, yeah. isn't there some kind of compromise or something? Uh, Ladies, can you believe this? I'm sorry, y'all. He's uh, but out of the parking space. I, I, if I don't feel respected, I, I am mean, not gonna go through I mean, with the rest come of the on. day. Well, I mean, you are serious. You're really leaving. Yeah. I mean, you didn't want this place anyway, right? I mean. I mean, I understand that I was late. I understand that. I understand that I could have been a bit more cooperative. You had, you made some good points. That's why I'm willing to compromise. Let her go, guys. Let her go. She doesn't want the stress. Let her go. Let her go. Why are we guys afraid to test women when it comes to money? So many guys are afraid to test their women with money. Why? Why? You know the inevitable. If you know very well the woman is the kind of woman that loves money, not like money. Everybody likes money. Good and fine. Money is great. So money is fine. Everybody, money is sweet. But you know where the woman can decide to go for money and not cherish a relationship. That's what you mean. That's what I mean. What I mean, please let her go. Don't be afraid as a guy to test your woman with money. Do it. Even some of us already know exactly what will be the answer, but do it anyway so that you will clear your doubt. Well, catch you next time.